There's a shortcut warp that leads straight to the witch, but you need a whip to cross this chasm. That's our leader, Major Dyluck. He's young, but no one doubts his skills. He knows how dangerous this mission is, but I've never seen the Major waver. Major Dyluck, sir. All set. Understood. Stay focused, men. Let's move out. There you are. Let's go. Luca. I guess I'll ask that girl over there. Hey, where do I find Luca? Mind your manners. It's nice to see you again, Sage Luca. <laughs> You're very welcome. Wait, you mean this little girl is 200 years old? Luca, monsters have started invading villages. This young boy just fought one himself. You underestimate my intelligence. World news flows into this palace with the water's own currents. Mana grows ever weaker. That could explain how this child was able to take the sword from its place of rest. His actions caused the balance of mana in this area to shift. Beasts are now rampaging across the land again. Evil in the world is working to seal away the power of the mana sword forever. By defeating monsters and obtaining their orbs, you can reforge and restore the sword's mana power. It looks like your sword regained some power from vanquishing the mantis ant. There are more hidden orbs with the mana power to revive the sword. You must find them. I was once one of Sage Lucas' pupils. I studied how mana sustains our entire world, and how it's been slowly fading away. Gemma, I want you to keep an eye on the Empire. It seeks the Mana Fortress's power. Fortress? Like the one that destroys the world in that fairy tale? This is no fairy tale. We're talking about the real Mana Fortress, and the Empire that wants its power. The Empire will try to break the seals on the Mana Seeds in each palace. I've already caught some Empire spies snooping around my own palace. There are strange reports coming in from Pandora. Could the Empire be involved? I do not know. Gemma, you should request an audience with the King and tell him to be wary of the Empire. Understood. I'll leave now. Head for the cave in Gaia's navel. There's a dwarf blacksmith that lives in the area. Dwarves are known for their weapon-making skills. You should see if they can reforge the sword. As the sword becomes more powerful, your skills will improve, and you'll learn more abilities. What frightens you so? You wield the legendary Mana Sword, but its power has faded. Now it's hardly better than a normal weapon. It used the last of its power to choose a new master. But, why did it pick me? I don't have that answer. But you drew the sword. And now it's your responsibility to restore its power. So, where do I fit in? You must become a hero who is worthy of the sword. Come, hold the sword up to the seed on the altar. What 
happened? The seed and the sword have now synchronized with each other. Now no matter where you are in the world, this mana seed can grant power to your mana sword. You found one of the eight palaces. Now you must visit the others and obtain the powers of their seeds. I worry about you out in the world with only a rusted sword. Take this spear I imbued with holy water. Use it along with the mana sword, and it too will regain its true power. I'll heal you. Would you like to save the game? First, take Gemma's advice and head to Gaia's navel. There you can find the underground palace. To reach Gaia's navel, head south through the kingdom of Pandora. I'll heal you. Would you like to save the- First, take Gemma's ad- To reach Gaia- 